So today I am going to discuss uh, the number system concept and this is my fourth lecture for the number system. Since this is, this is a you know a big topic and uh, so it requires a lot of time to discuss and uh, we are not we are not you know uh, going to rush through that topic. So today I am going to talk about a, a concept, two concepts. One is finding out whether a number is a perfect square or not and the second one is uh, finding out the remainder of a number, right? So starting with the whether the number is perfect square or not. 2, 1, 3, 2. Is this number a perfect square? Now, those who started doing, you know, finding out whether this number is perfect square or not, then it's not done. Why? Because this number is never gonna a perfect square. The numbers which ends with 2, 3, 7 and 8 are never going to be a perfect square. Now you have to keep it in your mind every single time. Either you write it in a copy or you write it in your mind. Numbers which ends with 2, 3, 7 and 8 are never be a perfect square. But the vice versa is not true. Means the numbers which ends with 0, 1, 4, 6, 9 and 5 are always going to be a perfect square. No, they may be, they may not be. So, taking another example. 3, 4, 5, 4, 6. Is this number a perfect square? Now, some of you started, you know, finding out whether this number is a perfect square or not. Some of you may say, it may be a perfect square, it may not be a perfect square. But my answer is, it's never going to be a perfect square. How? Let's make an observation. Number system, you know, is something which is a very common sense sort of thing. You have to observe the numbers, you have to play with the numbers, you have to flirt the numbers, then you are going to be the master of number system. Numbers which ends with 6 and a perfect square. You will have to write those numbers. First one is 16. 16 is a perfect square. It ends with 6. Other one is 36. Right? Other one is 196. Other one is 256. All these numbers are perfect square and which ends with 6. Now the next observation is very important. All these numbers which is a perfect square and ending with 6, the next number, next digit is always be a odd number. Here it is even number, so it's not going to be a perfect square. Similar, 2, 1, 3, 4. Is this number going to be a perfect square? Some of you may say that yeah, it may be a perfect square. Some of you say it may not be a perfect square. But my answer is it's never going to be a perfect square. Why? Once again observation. Observation numbers which ends with 4 and a perfect square. First one is 0, 4. Second one is 64. Third one is 144 all these numbers are perfect square in which ends with 4 right but the next is it is always be even number here it is or so it's not going to be a perfect square so now I'm going to generalize this thing numbers which ends with 6 and it's a perfect square, the next digit must be an odd number. And for rest of the numbers, it's always be even number. 
and this is this is this concept is being asked in the different exams in your placement paper as well as in CAT and GMAT and other GRE exams. So just keep it in your mind. Numbers which ends with six and a perfect square. The second digit is always be odd and for the rest of the perfect square numbers either it is ending with zero or one or say nine or four or five they have you know even number as the second digit you take an example numbers with, which ends with one and the perfect square 121 81 the next digit is even number Numbers which end with 5, 25, 625. Next one is even. Right. Numbers which I already taken 4. Now take 9, 49, 169. A perfect square. The next digit is even. Only in case of 6, it's odd. So now I'm going to give another question. 2, 1, 2, 4, is this number going to be a perfect square? And if your answer is yes sir, then you are wrong because it may be, it may not be. So, abhi jo humne tarika sikha, isse hum ye bata sakte hain ki nahi hua. Hum ye nahi bata sakte hain ki ye hoga. Hoga karne ke liye aapko nikalna padega. Root nikalna padega. Shandar ek concept mene sikhaya. Thank you, thanks a lot.